The graph shows the relationship between the number of shares of stock from company A, X, and the number of shares of stocks from company B, which is signified by Y, that Simone can purchase, which equation could represent this relationship. So the first thing I'm looking at when I see a graph, like I said, is always, okay, I see that it's basically decreasing, so the relationship is decreasing, so my slope is going to be negative. I have a negative slope here. So knowing that, I can automatically get rid of A, and I can automatically get rid of C. Those are not the correct answer choices. So what I can then do is I am left with B and D, and the only difference that I really see is the totals are both 480. It's just which you know, coefficient is correct, basically. So what I'm going to do is, next thing I look for is like the y-intercept. So when company A, when she gets 0, so when it's 0 here, so when basically x is equal to 0, y is equal to 40. So if I plug in to this, to number, to, sorry, answer choice B, if I plug in 0, I would be left with 12y is equal to 480. If I divide by 12, I get y is equal to 40. So I know the answer choice is 